we can adapt the sign convention with the shear force and bending moment that we derive for a beam to a column. So remember if we cut the beam from right to left for example, we use this sign convention. And to obtain a sign convention for the column in the frame, we simply rotate this sign convention anti-clockwise. So here for example if we cut the column from bottom to top, then we use this sign convention over here. So essentially this column will deform something like this under that point load because we have a rigid support so there's no rotation allowed at this joint so the column behaves like a cantilever and in frames the beams are rigidly connected to the columns so before and after deformation the beam and column remain at 90 degrees at the joint. So here we can observe the beam is going to be in tension on the top so the deformed section will look something like this and the column will be in tension on the left so the deformed section will look something like this please subscribe like and comment to help me reach more students